Okay, now we are going to solve question number 12. Let a and b be the two unit vectors such that a dot b equals 0 for some x, y belongs to R. Let c equals x a plus y b plus a cross b vector if modulus of c is 2 and vector c is inclined at the same angle alpha to both a and b then the value of a cos by alpha is what? Okay, so a dot b is 0, it means a and b perpendicular. By the way, c equals we have given over here. Oh, in this, we have to apply this one also. a dot a cross b is 0, we know. b dot also a cross b is 0. And a dot b itself 0 is given. Now, this c is given. This vector c equals x a plus y b plus a cross b, right? Now, if you remember one formula, then a plus b plus c mod square is mod a square, mod b square, mod c square plus twice of a dot b, b dot c, C dot right? We will apply this concept over here. Apply both sides mod like this and then square. So this is mod C square, this is x mod A square, this is y, b vector square, this is A cross B whole square, then plus twice of now we have to understand x <coughs> a dot b right x y dot a dot b a dot b is 0. Now b dot c, b dot a cross b, that is also 0. Now c a, I mean a cross b dot a, that is also 0. So mod c is given, that is 2. So this is 2 square, which is, which is, uh, okay, 2 is square. This is x square. And a and b are the two unit vectors. So magnitude of a is also 1. So this is times 1 y square b is also in vector so 1 and a cross b so this is uh, a cross b means mod a mod b sin theta then n cap and both mod a square this is 1 this is 1 by the way a and b a dot b is 0 it means a and b are perpendicular so angle between them is 90 degrees so from here this is 4 this is x square, this is y square. 1 times 1 times sin 90 is 1 and uh, n cap magnitude is also 1. So this is 1. So what we got? We got x square plus y square equal to 3. We got this relation. Okay. Now, c, c equals x a plus y b plus a cross b, right? Now, angle between c and a and c and b both are same, that is alpha. Apply both sides, dot a. So, this is c dot a, which is x. a dot a is mod a square, a is unit vector, so this is 1. Now, y dot, uh, y b dot a, that is 0. a dot b dot c, that is also 0. And c dot a means mod c, mod a, and cos alpha which is x. So from here we got mod c is 2, a is magnitude of a is 1. So we got 2 cos alpha here. Similarly apply both sides dot b. So this would be c dot b. This is x, a dot b that is 0. Now y b dot b, b dot b is mod modulus of b square that is 1. So only y. And a dot a cross b dot b that is 0. And this is mod c, mod b. Angle between b and c is also alpha, so cos alpha equals y. So here also we got y equals, this is 2, this is 1, cos alpha. So this is 2 cos alpha. So y is also 2 cos alpha. Now put those two things over here. Cos alpha whole square, which is 4 cos square alpha. Then y square again. 4 cos square alpha equals 3. So this is 8 cos square alpha. 
equal 3. Question was find the value of 8 cos square alpha. So 8 cos, 8 cos square alpha is 3. So it's a pretty simple question.